Now, norepinephrine is not very frequently used. However, you may consider it uh, at a dose of 0 0.02 to 0 0.4 microgram per kilo per minute. It has alpha-1 effect more than beta-1, more than beta-2 and uh, it causes potent vasoconstriction with the mild inotropy. So it's used in conditions with significant vasoplegia as I said in septic shock it can be uh, the inotrope of choice uh, if the pathophysiology would support in the post-surgical inflammation and in asphyxia as well. It, this is important as in these settings you may have a mild uh, pulmonary vasoconstriction so the pulmonary vasodilator effect will help. It can cause tachycardia and it may also affect the regional tissue perfusion due to potent vasoconstriction. So norepinephrine we should be familiar now as it's used more often and where it is dopamine resistance you can go to norepinephrine.